Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today we are doing our F1 2020 um, driver prediction round with constructors as well. So we're two in one. So we'll start off and I'm gonna go and keep Mazapin for 20th. Um because I just don't think he had that experience before in racing for Latifi I think. He's only really in Williams really though, I think, for the money and stuff. Good job for Nazi, I think. He put up, he did all right last season, I think. Um, but I think I don't know if he'll carry that momentum in. Mick Schumacher, I think he's pretty decent. You know. George Russell, you know, very good. Um, Rackin and plot so long. Sonoda, I don't think he's ready, but I put him in 14. I've got Esteban knock on and Fernando Alonso. 12th and 13th, um, I don't think the Alpine car will be that good, you know, now Alonso and Ocon instead of Ricardo and Ocon. And Stroll 11th, I think, he did alright last season, but I think now he's not against Perez, I feel like it will be harder. we got Gasly in 10th, he just maxes out that car all the time. Science in 9th, I think he'll do good in his first year at Ferrari, but not as good as Nicola. Norris in 8th, I don't think he'll do as good as Ricardo. We've got Leclerc in uh, seventh, I think like he maxed out that Ferrari last year in you know, that draggy car and he made it very good. We've got Vettel, the Aston Martin, join Aston Martin. I feel like he will be maxing that car out like as much as Sergio Checo did. Um we've got Ricardo in fifth. I put Ricardo in fifth because like you know what he can do in like a big team like he did in Red Bull and I feel like he could really push that car, you know, as much as Science and Norris did last year. But I think he's a better driver than Science. But I'm not, I'm not sure about that. Perez, you know, Red Bull. I think he'll definitely be round four. For Asford, and this is close. I was thinking about putting, you know, switching these around. Hamilton first. It depends on his size. And for Stappen second, it's close, but you know, we have to put, you know, see what happens. Now it's 10th to 1st, because it's a task, and it's not that good of a car. Williams, he said that they big bring some big upgrades, which nice news. Alfa Romeo, and I think they'll just finish the same as they did last year. Alfa Tower is 7th, I don't think they'll get any better. Alpine, I think. Sit, but I don't think they'll be as close as what they thought it would be. And we've got Ferrari, I think I'll put them fifth because I feel like their drivers will max that out more than what they did last year. McLaren and then Austin Martin, I think Austin Martin because Vettel's got that experience and might teach Lance Stroll a bit more. And I've got Red Bull because I think they've got two solid drivers in there. As much as I did like Alex Albon, he's my favourite. Yeah, they have got more experience and like the staff has only got a bit more Tequila in the team. And then Mercedes, they'll win it for hope, like probably win it eight times now. So, yeah, pretty much the same. There's nothing that really can be changed of this from this year, but yeah. Right, thank you for watching this video and goodbye.